What is it, you guys? It's your boy, Raging Gamer, and welcome back to another spooky, scary Sunday. Woo! All right, Spooky Scary Sunday. For those of you that are new, is a series where. Y'all didn't see that. Y'all didn't see that. Where every Sunday, the samurai, Corey Kenshin's community, get together, and we have a blast. We sit back and we watch some spooky, scary videos sent in by you guys via Twitter. Uh huh. I said it this time because I actually picked some Twitter, some videos out from Twitter. Oh, I was X, but I still call it Twitter. That won't change. It won't. Look, look me in my eye. That will not change. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep calling it Twitter. You send in the scariest video you know using the hashtag Spooky Scary Sunday. And if your video gets picked, you get a shout out. With all that out of the way. Or actually, no. Nope, we're not done yet. As you guys know, I have been doing this series in honor. I, I don't know. It seems like when I say in honor, it sounds like Corey died or something. No, he didn't die. He just hasn't uploaded in a year. But I've been doing this series, you know, for Corey. I'm not the only one out there either. There's been a bunch of other content creators out there, you know, doing stuff um, for Corey Kenshin in his absence on YouTube. So um, I do recommend checking them out too. W content. So, but yeah, now with all that out of the way, first video. <laughs> Alrighty, so the first, 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 Jesus, voice crack. The first video this week is called The Horror Attraction, and this video was uploaded by Baddington. I know, some of y'all haven't heard that name in a long time. Neither have I. Now, this video was sent to us by 21, I don't know if we should call them 21 or by their at, which is, yeah, let's call them 20, Luke. Luke, I don't, I don't know. I don't want to say the first part. Rano, Luke. Uh, sorry, I, I'm not good with names. Okay. Um, and they said, "You will come back. You will come back, Corey. I can. You will come back. My cat is literally crawling up my leg as we speak right now. Look at Ginger. Say we love Ginger. Like, can we get, can we get some W Gingers in the, in the comments? I'm oh, sorry, babies. All right. But yeah, let's get into it. Oh, we're not even full screen. And uh, yeah, uh, snacks. I always forget this. Uh, I really don't have nothing on me personally right now. So uh, get yourself some nice popcorn. And uh, wash it down with some water. Stay hydrated. This Halloween, Freddy's is having a grand reopening at the Washington Ooh. County Fair. Of Freddy Fazbear's Pizza at Fazbear Fright. Okay, okay, the whole okay. Attraction. Tickets are now available at HurricaneHaunts.com. Sure, I might have to go over to Hurricane Haunts, bro. Give me some tickets. What's the quality we're watching this at? Oh. Bruh, no, we gotta watch the 720p. What are we doing? Yo, this would honestly be dope. Honestly, like, I'll honestly go to something like this. Kind of remind me of Ghost Blasters at Illages until they took it away. <laughs> That's not what happened. So apparently, the course as a decoration for the ride. You want that? It's like so just. Disgusting. It's like, like so disgusting. Like yeah, it would smell like Count Barstool out of here from last Halloween. It was one time. Hope you girls went to the bathroom so you don't pee your pants. Shut up. George, hurry up. You're gonna slow us down with that thing. <sighs> sorry. Whoa, sorry kid. It's only three per car. Uh, hey, guys. <gasps> oh my god, uh, Derek! Guys, what about George? What about that car back there? So 
I stood corrected. He did hop in that court back there. Yeah, let's see, like I said, it reminds me of Ghost Blasters. If, if y'all haven't seen Ghost Blasters, uh, just search up Illich Gardens Ghost Blasters and you'll see probably like a video of someone going through it. You get a little gun, you go, ow, ow, it was cool until they changed it. I guess I would go. I would, I would go in something like this. Like that would be pretty fun. Shoot, take take some notes. Take some notes. Someone gotta make something like this. With the door just opening up. Boom. We getting through it, we getting through it. Go over through. Dude, I cannot see I cannot see them, bruh. Okay, there we go. Okay, mate. Okay. Oh shit. Oh, is the ride broken? And right in front of these three, something's gonna pop off, or something's gonna happen. You better not get up, dude. Door's closed. I really should have just begged Vanny to come with me, huh? Talking about them, bro. They gonna be on your neck. I thought I saw one of them turn their heads like that. Bro. I'm just, it might have been the lights or something. that door. Oh. <laughs> keep no, keep your eyes on that. No one mentioned a drop. A uh, drop? Man, I already seen this already. Why did that scare me? Also, why is rooms. why is he looping? 
I don't think they reuse roofs, but I don't think it's that big. What? Those were on TV before, were they? They weren't. They weren't. Those faces were not on TV before. Oh, he's not there. He's not there. He's not there. Dude, dude, get that in your head. He's not there. The bunny is not there. Seriously? This no, no, seriously, nothing. The bunny is not there, bro. You've already seen all these rooms. You should, you should know. And it got stuck again. You put me through the whole ride again just to break down in the same spot? Bruh. Uh, Bro, the, bun great. the bunny wasn't there, this man. This is really not gonna wait for me. Wait a minute. What? What are we waiting a minute for? What do you see? Oh no, guys, watch out for the black light, but... Oh shit. Why'd you stand up, Goofy? Yes, just please let this end. It said, stay seated at all times, bruh. What you standing up for? Oh shit! Damn, why'd it open like that? He ain't in there either. Go ahead, turn the light on. He's not there either. You're done, bro. You're cooked. You're done. You're done, buddy. Okay, just the one I drop and everything will be fine. Pro is in a loop. But but the thing though is like there's the, the freaking spring bunny is missing. He's not there. Is there gonna be anything else missing this time? I, yeah, okay, you, you ain't gonna give me a third time. You got me a second time somehow, but you're not gonna give me a third time. This can't be real. It is was it always right in there? I'm starting to forget some stuff now. But I do know those children were on the TV the first time. And then the damn bunny missing. In both freaking rooms. That happened earlier than usual. Dude, have you not you not got in your head? It's a loop, bruh. You in a loop. Oh, it's talking this time. Last time I wasn't talking. It was gone and they weren't talking. And it, that light wasn't red. You were able to see the box, like, perfectly. Uh, is he gonna stop again? Please. Please don't stop again. And stop. I'm telling you, he's gonna pop up in this room, like, with him, everyone is wants to stop him. Are you getting out again, bruh? I mean, I probably would too at this point, honestly. There's gotta be an emergency exit somewhere. What? Hey! Ooh! No, that's the bunny, Where dude. Derek is behind all this.
That's the bunny, bro. Anyone back here? The fuck? Wait! What the hell? Get me off the ride! Huh? It's not fucking funny anymore! It's not funny anymore! Let me out! Let me out! I really I like this VHS type like recording though it's kind of cool even though like I can barely see some of the things that I thought my quality was bad but <laughs> I like it though. Falling down, falling down, falling down, London Bridge. What the fuck? Ooh! Stop! Get back here! Get me off this ride! Oh man, I won't be messing with. Whoa! Away. Oh, you fucking... Ooh, okay. No, 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 fuck! Fuck, 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 fuck! Aren't you gonna beat up the animatronics or something? Damn, he really is. Damn, bro, what'd they do to you? Should be beating up the Brody who keeps peeking at you at that door. Please don't shut down. Please. It's gonna shut down. Please, please. It's it's gonna shut down. God fucking damn it! God, stupid fucking. Watch your buffet. What you gonna push it? Come on. Yeah, I don't think that's gonna work, buddy. Oh. Okay, Mr. Muscles, all right. <laughs> Whoa, the lights turned off, but the ride didn't start this time. Bro, peeking through the door still, like last time. Look at the door. It looks closed. Yeah, it's closed. It's like halfway open though. Damn, I gotta sneeze again. Ooh. Hey. Ooh, go get him. Go get him. Stop. What the what? frick? What the fuck? It's a robot? You're making progress. <sighs> it's all fake. None of it is real. It's nothing but props, costumes, and cheap scares.
light. God, how many doors does this place need? Spring trap. No, that's 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 when he came up there and they were like, oh, now I'm showing spring trap or whatever the frick. And then and he was gone, and that door is open. Why would anyone need a? Oh shit! No! Vanessa! No! Vanessa! What the frick? Frick is that? Ooh. What is that? Oh, is it? <laughs> oh, what the frick, man? Oh, great. You're done. We got open. Get on the ride. Actually, no. Freak the ride. Run. Run. You're, you're going to be faster than the ride. You'll be faster than the ride. Get off the ride. Dude. Run. Why are you relying on that ride? That ain't moving. Slow as freak. You will run faster than that. I would not be on that. Come on. Go on. Move. No! No! Ooh! Not again. Wait. What? It's over? Where the hell am I? I'm outside. Please. Stop. Please. Please. Please stop. Just get out then. Get out. Just get out. You've done it before. Oh my god. It stopped. I can leave. Holy shit. I can leave. What's that noise? Hello? Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Oh, it's in front. No. Don't get back on that. You like like that's gonna do something. Now why won't you just let me leave? What a great outfit. Oh. Oh. Corey, I'm fine. <laughs> I 
I assume these must be like a uh, Patreon supporters or something like that, or just channel supporters. How long we got left? We got another minute. Let's see. Let's uh. Ever felt trapped? All right, we're not worrying worry about no ads. Batting ten. Y'all, y'all did that, bro. That was, that was good. That was freaking, ooh. All right, ooh. On the next one. Alrighty, so the next one we got is called Kelly's Last Review by Alter, and this was sent to us by Ave, Ava, Ava. I don't, I don't know. Ava, Ava. It says Ava right there, then Ava. And and they said, Yo, Corey, I've been subbed to your channel a while, and honestly, the end of this video almost made me puke. Oh boy, we're gonna be in for a freaking ride. Also, can I have a neutral grade bar? Oh, I had a feel this question was gonna come up sooner or later. Um, and due to the fact of me, you know, not being Corey and not having the neutral grade bars on deck, uh, fortunately, I can't give that to you. But you know who can give it to you? Cory. Neutral Green Bar, Strawberry Edition. Open your mouth up. Alright, let's get it. Hey guys, it's me, Callie with the K and a Y, your favorite beauty blogger. But this is just like how they beat. Oh, me? me? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Your favorites <laughs> might have more experience or subscribers or sponsorships or partnerships. Yeah, comp. Wait. I don't know. Oh, straight out of mascara. It's a freaking straight out of comedy thing, but it's straight out of mascara. Real, okay. Truthful and honest reviews of products that I think are going to change your life. Today's video is my first ever sponsored review of this exclusive new at home chemical peel kit from Sue Skincare. Don't ask me why, but I've seen stuff like this before. Right. They, 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 they're on point with a this. Chemical peel at home. So they reached out to me. They're this cool new startup. Sponsorship. They asked if I would do mm, a, a startup mm. tutorial and review of this product, which I was super excited about because I don't have that many subscribers yet, mm. which I'm working on. I'm kind of like one of the first people who's able to even try this product. I think I got kind of like a little, little misprint. Just no big deal. But I, like her face is a little bit like, you know. Oh my god! I completely <laughs> forgot to say. I have any information on. It's a mess. So if we just take a little look, see here, hyperpigmentation and rosacea on my cheeks, fine lines on my eye area whenever I make an expression. My forehead is another story. I mean, take a look at this. It would be amazing if this peel could just get rid of everything. I can't wait to start sharing this with you. Oh, I feel like, I feel like she's gonna regret saying that. Hey guys, it is application day. I am super excited to get going with this. Again, sorry, no foundation, but obviously can't put a peel on over foundation, so I need to be au natural. <laughs> There's no instructions on the product, but I've been emailing with Sue myself with a really Don't talk about rep. her stretch They've face again. me everything I need to know. Let's get going. Step number one, make sure that you have gloves on. You don't want your hands to peel. Unless you have acne on your hands, in which case, like, I can't help you. And then we are going to take our product. Ooh, very powerful chemicals in there. I don't have quite the formula for you yet. I just know it's powerful. <laughs> and because that's what you want, because that's what will work. Then we're going to take this cute little fan brush, dip that in here. Be careful there's not like excess drips. That was a little bit of an excess drip. <laughs> Give it a few minutes to wait. Okay, so it's only been about right. um, a minute and a half. I feel like my face is getting really tight, and I see there's actually quite a bit of redness. Mm. So I think we're. I'm, I think I'm gonna. I'm gonna neutralize now. So that is what um, the neutralizing cream is for. Should have done this a little bit earlier, actually. Oop. Rub that all over where you applied the peel. Gosh, that is a tricky little bottle here. I'm yeah, actually I'm just gonna use it like this. It feels so nice. It's like a ketchup bottle. 
when you pop the sides of ketchup bottles, like a little baby butt comes out a little better, but that's okay. almost not even happening here. I'm gonna go. I mean, I can relate to it, but okay. So you think hey we're guys, So quick change of plans. I'm actually gonna run out and get some coconut oil because the rep said that that is pretty similar in um, like formula to what the neutralizing agent is. I actually ran out of <laughs> the neutralizing agent. I don't know if that's just because maybe I'm like, maybe just like a baby. <laughs> yeah, I, I kind of need some more of that because this is just sort of itchy and starting to feel a little bit intense, but I think that's kind of normal. So I'm gonna go grab some of that and I will let you guys know how things are later. Okay, bye. Um, one other thing, oh, I got my coconut oil. One other thing I did wanna say is you are not supposed to go out in the sun with this. <laughs> I obviously am in the sun right now, but I think it should be fine because it's just a short little walk back to my apartment. It's like a 10 minute walk, I'm walking fast. <laughs> I think it should be fine because I'm gonna be neutralizing more, some extra neutralization. I think it should be okay. So, but I just wanted to tell you because I'm always trying to be honest with these things. All right, I'll check in with you guys later when there's some progress. Hey guys, so it's actually only about like 10 hours later. There's obviously been some like really incredible progress. So what's happening right now is a lot of that bad stuff is starting to come to the surface at like like crustify. A really, really crazy thing is that there's actually stuff that was like hiding underneath my skin. Oh my God, my bangs look crazy. I'm sorry. This section over here, on, like honestly, I think that's just like pores that I didn't even know were clogged. Yikes. The main thing is just like keeping it clean and like making sure you're not picking at stuff. Oh, oops. That's, um, should have, should have cleaned that up before. I just have like a little bag of things I'm keeping in here. I will check in with you guys later. Good night. Hey guys. Uh, I definitely don't want to sugarcoat things. Things are definitely feeling a little tender Dang. today. Everything is like definitely activated. It's for sure crustified, as we said. But um, I know that it's a point you're, you're, where the you're very sugarcoating things. To form underneath. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Sometimes that like loosens things up a little bit. I got one. <laughs> Just want to make sure that you're not actually like just sitting there like peeling it going a little stir crazy it's kind of a nice weekend but like this is all gonna be worth it i would never use that product again probably the most disappointing update that i could even have imagined what that one band-aid gonna Skin do care no longer wants to what's that other band-aid up there gonna do the sponsorship with me they you know, basically want to call the whole thing off. Their email addresses are no longer um, functional. Now, mm. I can't get in touch with them. I feel like they go with the Maybe because they you weren't know? what they said they were. They're trying to blame me, but maybe I have, like, kind of sensitive skin. I think that I just have a more intense healing process than, than we were expecting. Oh, I'm sorry. Trying not to let my emotions get. I think I'm just. I have been sleeping. It's pretty rude of Sue Skincare to give up. I never give up. I stay positive, even when when things seem tough. I I move forward and I keep doing it. Abandoning the project is the worst thing that you can do. Sue Skincare made a mistake. I think they made a big mistake. I do this for you. For my followers, you guys are my everything. I'm gonna finish this video without them and finish this peel. They're gonna regret not choosing me to be the sponsored face of Sue Skincare's brilliant reveal chemical peel. I wouldn't even care about them, honestly, after all that. The final results. Oh boy. Kelly Shannon had a total of a subscriber count of eight. 
no email correspondence with anyone from South. Good care. Some no one has been able to find website contact of any other verification that company exists. The only recent emails in Kelly's inbox were online order confirmations from DIY product packing materials and 100% triathlon acid. Acid. Y'all bringing some heat this week. Okay. On to the next one. Alrighty, for the last video this week, we got Disguise by Tyler Sijawowski. I don't know how to say, <laughs> I don't know how to say that name, okay? I'm, I'm sorry about that. There's going to be another name I don't know how to say coming up, too. This was sent to us by Erica that said, hey, girl. Whenever you decide to come back from retirement, I don't think he's retired, I think he's just taking a break right now. Uh, me and my cousin found this video and thought of you. Love from my, see this is the name, my, my, Mayan, Myanmar? I probably said that like so wrong and I apologize. I apologize, I'm not good with names. I'm sorry. Alright, let's get into it. Guys. I'm thinking. I'm just not thinking about it too. When Corey gets back, he gonna have some mad videos. Uh, he gonna have a lot of selection. <laughs> <clears throat> What's going on up there? be like a Halloween decoration or something I don't trust that one right there I look too human like I look like someone in there and you just heard noise in your attic too why is she gonna keep looking away and something gonna be gone all right what's missing See, we focusing on that one because that one looks suspicious. 
Okay, we knew that we know that chicken wasn't the one. I heard making noises. Don't be playing with me. Man, I'll go over there. <laughs> just, just, just because, just because I feel something in my head, like something ain't right. I, I'm not even gonna lie. I be see that when I was younger, I would see stuff. I would just go over there, start, mm, mm, I start beating it up for no reason. Yup. Yup. Okay. Yup. Like I thought. Don't act like you ain't. Like, I don't act like you ain't see him. Just, just move over. Just. Don't act like you ain't see that. He did it again. See you. Where the freak he go? Did he just fall? What are you looking for? Didn't you not just fall? Why is it dark down there now? <laughs> Yoink! I'm sick. I'm living in this attic. I live in this attic now. Close it up. I mean, he can just open it, but... What's that paddle gonna do? I don't think I would go down there. You must not have your phone on you because I would be ring ring hello 911 there's some weird dude out here messing around. I don't, maybe not like that but dude in my attic. Some unwanted guests we have a break in or something like that. I don't know. <laughs> I thought we were finna. <laughs> All right. Don't even mess with him, bro. Just get out. Just go. Go away. Like look at him and then just like get out of there. Seems like he only move when you're not staring at him. You gonna go give him a whack with the paddle? Go ahead, give him a little tap since you're already there. Crusty toes is that? What the? Was that her? Did she just hit herself with a bat? Put them grippers away. Why you got straw in your pants? It is her. Why are you hitting yourself? How did you? One of y'all is not the real one.
Stop showing him grippers! Your life was mine. I took it from you. I'm taking it back. Damn. Man, what is even? Where was she? Well, that was something. My hair is itchy. Ah. Alrighty, well. There you have it. We recorded for a pretty dang long time. Ooh, it's gonna have to get on that editing grind. Even though I'm probably gonna shortly edit this one too because. Hate to say it, but your boy is running on another time crunch. Oh, all right. But 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. 10. Come with some more heat next week. Spooky Scary Sunday.